what's up today. That was like a shape house intro, so like, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> today is another Let's Talk About It episode. You're talking about the Mandela Effect. Now, many of y'all are like, what the f is a Mandela Effect? I'm gonna tell you. Basically, it's when a large group of people remember something happening in history that never happened, or in the past that never happened. Like, let's just start off with a few examples. Chick-fil-A. People always remember it being spelled C-H-I-C-F-L-A. Wrong. It's always been spelled C-H-I-C-K-F-L-A. But like, I even remember, like, holding a Chick-fil-A cup that said C-H-I-C. Like, no C-H-I-C-K. Like, there was never a... <sighs> Sorry, I have a word. Let's man, I love those things. I'm gonna go grab my laptop. I have tons of examples. Oh, God. There's, like, water on my laptop. Oh, God. Gosh, gosh. It's, like, dripping. Stop. Fudge, where did this stupid water come from? I got all over the keyboard. Oh, my gosh. I just did something. That is no bueno. Plus, I think it's a concept break for three minutes. But, you know, me and Ramen, we aren't working out together. Anyways, so, a few Mandela effect examples. Um, y'all remember the show Sex in the City? Do you? Do you? Do you? Well, you're wrong. It's always been sex and the city. Sex and the city. Even people have examples, like, seeing stuff, like, that they got that said sex in the city. Alright, you want proof of the Mandela effect? Besides some bullshit Photoshop pictures? Sex in the city. But it's always been sex and the city. What? So you're here to tell me that every time on TV, it never said sex in the city, it always said sex and the city? Like, no. I don't, I don't accept that. And the worst example of all, Monopoly Man. Remember Monopoly Man? Remember him always having a little, I forget what he's called, but like, little, little, little glass thing here, always like having it there? He never had it! Sorry. Just bother me so much. And I remember, I remember Pikachu always having black on the tip of his tail. I remember that so clearly. And he always has. He always has. I remember seeing it look exactly like that. I remember it completely looking exactly like that. And you're here to tell me that I was wrong the entire time? This one is what bothered me the most. Chick-fil-A. Well, not Chick-fil-A. Curious George. Y'all remember Curious George, you know, swinging on his tail throughout the trees and the forest and whatnot? Because I do. I remember that completely clear. Of him always swinging on his tail. But yeah, you're here to tell me that he never had a tail? Like, that is offensive to me, actually. He's always had a dang tail. I know it. I've seen it. I know that tail. But I was wrong? Whatever. I'm a Star Wars geek. I'm going to admit that. I have Star Wars balloons. I'll show you. I have Star Wars posters, Star Wars balloons, Star Wars everything. Star Wars action figures. Literally everything in my room is nothing but Star Wars. You're telling me that in Star Wars, Darth Vader never said, Luke, I am your father? Obi-Wan never told you what happened to your father. He told me enough. He told me you killed him. Luke, I am your father. Darth Vader never said, Luke, I am your father. Obi-Wan never told you what happened to your father. He told me enough. 
He told me you killed him. No. I am the father of all. He never said it? I specifically remember and heard him say, Luke, I am your father. But no. He always said, no. I am your father. And I'm a Star Wars geek? Can I call myself a Star Wars geek? I was wrong the entire time. <sighs> that one really shook me. And then there's another one that really, really bothered me. Kit Kat. Kit Kat logo. All of y'all remember it as being the one with the dash, right? Everyone remembers Kit Kat having the dash. Even I remember Kit Kat having the dash. And I'm being told that Kit Kat never had a dash. Are you serious? Kit Kat has never had a dash between Kit and Cat. It's always been Kit Kat. No dash. I don't know why this is bothering me so much. Like, normally stuff like this doesn't bother me. But like, I've been doing a lot of studying lately on Mandela Effect and just discovering all this information that I thought something has been something since the beginning of time. Kit Kat always had that dash. I'm sorry, I'm so... Oh! I have a very strong feeling about this. But Kit Kat has always had a dash. Like, you guys, do you guys remember Kit Kat having that dash in between Kit and Cat? Because I certainly do. And you're here to tell me that it's always been life was like a box of chocolates? I don't believe that. I never... No, it's always been life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you'll get. Not life was like a box of chocolates. What? <sighs> Sorry, guys. I'm real shook right now. But... I am going to finish making my pasta. I'm going to relax and pretend like this never happened. Make sure you all leave a like, favorite, and subscribe and comment below. And I'll see you all next week. Happy holidays. Always been Luke, I am your father. It's always been Kit Kat with a dash. It's always been C H I C dash. Not C H I C K dash. And there's a bunch more if you guys want me to say more, to do more videos like this video. Okay, I think this is done.